We are here for the next edition of our Multifamily Investor Nation Summit Speaker Introduction Series. And with us today is Ryan McKenna with McKenna Capital. Ryan, welcome to this series. Thanks, Dan. I'm excited to be here. Well, I want you to kind of get us started and share with us a little about you and your background and, uh, and why you love multifamily so much. Great, great. Well, I uh, was first introduced to I guess, multifamily syndication back in uh, 2002, actually when I was playing baseball at Arizona State University. Uh, a teammate of mine, his father was a multifamily syndicator and uh, he'd always be coming into town to you know, watch his son play baseball, but he'd be looking at uh, you know, these large apartment complexes in, in Arizona. And uh, you know, I got to talking with him one day and just really learned a little bit about the business and what he was doing, how lucrative it was. And then you know, he also shared with me just what a syndication was. So how they were pooling together a bunch of investors to buy all these apartment complexes. And I just thought that was really cool. And uh, he kind of became like a, a mentor to me um, over the years. And uh, I just told myself, you know, I want to do that someday. That, that's, that's pretty neat. And uh, also at the same time, I came across Rich Dad, Poor Dad. And uh, that book was, you know, it's been like a blueprint for me as far as being an investor, business owner, and, uh, you know, just really about you know building up assets and uh, finding deals that you know that cash flow and so um, after kind of uh, you know seeing so much of this go on um, you know even while I was in college uh, I guess if I fast forward to 2006 that's when I made my first investment uh, kind of dipped the toe in the water like most do with uh, a single family rental and uh, it was a way for me to really learn I guess the property management business learn what it's like to, to deal with tenants um, also learn um, what I don't like to do. And, uh, you know, after probably a few uh, single family rentals, I, I just knew I, in order to scale this business, I had to, you know, get back to the, you know, multifamily, you know, syndicated deals. And so I, I reached back out to my mentor um, and, you know, did my first five deals with him as a passive equity investor and uh, really was learning the business inside and out. And then I continued to do more passive equity deals with other syndicators just because I wanted to get a good sense for what was out there, you know, the different markets and just build out my experience and learn as much as I could because, you know, I had every intention at some point of syndicating my own deals. And um, I, I guess if, if I look back, you know, two years ago, I started McKenna Capital and uh, along the way, you know, I had friends and family that were interested in what I was doing. They, um, you know, said, "Hey, whenever you get an opportunity, you know, keep me in the loop. Let me know." And and the the deals I was doing early on, um, I just really didn't have any other opportunity to bring others along. And so uh, that was kind of the, the impetus for doing McKenna Capital and and trying to find our own deals. And then uh, as I was building that out, I had an opportunity that came my way to uh, to bring in equity into others' deals. And um, that was something that was was new to me. Um, I had always been interested in, in raising capital, but um, to bring in and partner with other operators out there who have a you know successful track record and great deal flow um, for me, it was a perfect match in uh, you know someone who has a pretty big network and had a following of people that were interested and and so kind of hit the ground running with the, the capital raising business and uh, absolutely love it. Um, it's been a way to get me more involved in, in deals, but also to bring in investors to um, you know, this this great asset class. And um, you know, as it sits today, I'm, I'm an investor in over 25 uh, commercial real estate syndicated deals. Uh, we had a great year um, at McKenna Capital last year, and what is basically the first year of capital raising for for our business. We did 12 deals, uh, nine value add multifamily, two self storage, and one manufactured home park fund. And uh, we're sitting right now at just over 5,000 units and uh, a portfolio, portfolio value of about 500 million. That's exciting, and and I'm I'm looking forward to, to you know talking with you a little bit more on at the event too, and and hearing your session. Uh, what's going to be the topic that you're going to be uh, speaking on at the event? So I'm speaking on raising private capital, which I think that fits very well with what you did in 2018. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, no, it's great. And I, I've learned a lot from others and uh, I'm going to be sharing, um, you know, what has worked for me. Uh, I've gotten a lot of feedback from my investors after, you know, having hundreds of conversations uh, just around, you know, the type of deals they're interested in, uh, the style of communication, just talking about building out your brand and creating awareness um, and, and a thought leadership platform. Um, one of the things that I, I think is, um, 
you know, there's so much potential out there. I mean, there's so many people that don't even know these types of deals exist. And then, you know, the benefit, everyone that gets into real estate, you know, wants to build and grow their wealth and, and have that passive income stream. And I just haven't found a better vehicle out there um, than, than the real estate syndicated deals. So just as far as, you know, helping educate others and, uh, you know, where to find investors, those are some of the things that I'm going to be sharing. And just some of the tips and things I've learned over, you know, my, my investing years, but also most recently in the capital raising role. And and uh, and as far as this event's concerned, why do you feel like people that are listening right now should attend an event like this? I mean, I, I look at it and say, why not? I mean, you you put together a phenomenal lineup of speakers. I mean, there's 55 or 60. It's basically the the who's who of the the multifamily investing world. And uh, you know, me as someone who loves to you know learn and and just continuously try to kind of build and and grow. I'm excited just to see all the other speakers and as an investor out there, I mean, they're going to just be able to hear and learn from so many other experienced, um, you know, real estate investors. And the beauty of the the setup and the, and the virtual aspect of it is very unique. Um, you know, you have the, the ability to go back and watch videos over and over again. And I think that part is, is pretty cool because when you go to a conference, you're able to probably pick and choose who you want to listen to. And, and, you know, you kind of pick up a nugget or two, but with this format and style, I mean, you're able to go back and rewatch videos, um, which I think is very important because some people learn better that way. Maybe they want to see something two or three times. And I, I think just kind of have that library at their disposal is very valuable, but then just the ability to connect and, and, and network. And, um, you know, this business is all about partnerships and the fact that you're going to be able to connect all of us through, um, you know, the emails, uh, it's a great opportunity to follow up even after the event with others and just connect. And, you know, this, is a, this, this is, you know, a teamwork type business and we're all, you know, kind of in this together. And so that I think there'll be a lot of great partnerships that will be formed. And, uh, I think everyone is going to be really, um, you know, excited to be part of this. And, and I know you're giving out a no risk guarantee, a hundred percent money back if you're not happy. And I don't, I don't know who would want to, you know, pass that up um, for, for the value that you're putting together with this deal. So I'm really excited that you're doing this. And again, I, I'm, I'm lucky and happy uh, to be part of it. Well, it's one of those things that, you know, I wanted to make sure that there was nothing holding somebody back from being able to take the take the plunge and, you know, making the investment in themselves and actually being in a part of this event. Because let's just say that their, their, their fear is that they spend, you know, right now it's three forty nine and I'm going to have you give out your promo code so you could, they can get another hundred dollars off of that. So it'll be two forty nine right now. But, you know, the, the risk of losing two forty nine at a, on an event that they show up for or, or and it's just a terrible event, which, you know, throw out there that the hundred percent money back guarantee. If you don't like the event for whatever reason afterwards, yeah. you just send me an email. And I'll give you a refund. But I guarantee you that you will love this event. You will learn so much from it. It only takes one golden nugget to change you. So, Ryan, what is that promo code that they can use to be able to uh, get that discount for that, for that uh, $100 off? It's uh, McKenna. So M-C-K-E-N-N-A. -N -N just so when you're going to the MFINsummit.com page and you put in your email to go to the checkout page, there'll be a place there for you to put in your promo code. So put in McKenna, M-C-K-E-N-N-A, -N -N and you'll get $100 off your ticket. Ryan, thank you so much for being with us here today. I wish you the very best and look forward to hearing you next week as well at the event. Okay. Thanks, Dan. Appreciate it.